up everybody, <coughs> it's uh, Andy here, and today I've got some Armour 2 gameplay for you. Uh, this is filmed on my new computer, which I got a couple days ago. Uh, it's basically for playing games, so now I can play PC games instead of uh, Mac games, so it's a, a big step up, I guess. Um, it's um, a custom mission, what I'm playing. I made it be a took about 10 minutes, 15 minutes, not too long. Uh, it's just basically a big battle. I had everything on like highest settings. I maxed out the units. I put in I think, like well over 100 units in here. So I didn't max out the units. I just put in a lot of units until basically what I thought it could handle. Uh, so it's running quite alright here. Um, it's basically a mission where we've got to take out a terrorist threat in a village. I put in about mm, 50 US troops. Uh, convoys, two of them, um, and a big helicopter squad, and uh, yeah, so this is basically the footage of the soldier on foot, um, basically just hiding behind my tank, letting the guys kind of pick off who they can see, and then in the distance we can see uh, the convoys, they're slowly pushing forward. Here's kind of the overview, to the left we have a small group of uh, heavily, like, little tanks or whatever, and then the convoy was coming from the right, so basically showed you what was going on. So here we go, the men are moving forward, I'm moving forward. Make sure I don't really like run in there and die because I don't want to like die because then you have to restart the mission, no checkpoints. And that's kind of irritating. But here we go, check to make sure there's no one hiding. Looks pretty clear. So I tell my men to move there and move forward. Doesn't really work too well, the men kind of just stay where they are, they don't really run too forward. It's kind of sucks, but either way. So here we go. We've got some guys on the left who just saw running forward. Just kind of to cover the area. And make sure these corners are clear, because an enemy could just kill you before you know it. So here we see the uh, convoys. Now, they don't just charge into the town. They slowly kind of like, one by one, let a single vehicle forward. So there goes the Humvee. Just boom. Gone. And then we get to see the derp. BMP, who just, yeah, just doesn't even realise that there's a broken BMP in front of him. Uh, or LAV, BMP, LAV, jeez, LAV. Um, now yeah, I'm moving forward, still my men aren't like moving forward, so I can't tell them to move forward a bit more. Uh, there's a Humvee out to the left side, and check the corners again, make sure there's no one hiding there. There we go. Then I can't to here. I'll check my map, see uh, see where the boys are at. But they're still kind of held back. Slowly moving forward, but yeah, I'm still kind of like taking point. So I move forward up here, check my corner, and there's a little surprise around there, I believe. Peep around there, peep around again, and what's that? It's an enemy. Make sure it's all clear. Looks clear. And I was a bit intrigued whether that was our soldier or their soldier, but it was their soldier. And uh, yeah. So I want my men to come back up on me. So I tell my men move here, but they still don't come there. So I tell them to regroup on me, but it's still taking forever to get here. They just take ages. So there's some more soldiers off in the distance. And there's some more, and there's my soldiers. Now, this is kind of a, a, a bad choice by me. Don't really, really know what I was doing. I was just watching this BMP, I'm like, alright, if the BMP's moved forward, then it's pretty safe up here. I check here, I see an enemy, I take him out. So the area's pretty clear, the BMP's moved forward. I'm like, alright, I might run alongside of the BMP. And, yeah, you guessed it, I jumped over here. I'm like, actually, it's a really bad choice, I don't want to do that. I jumped back and I just got dropped. So, yeah. But I hope you guys enjoyed that uh, video clip. Uh, right now, I'll just show you the uh, bird's eye view of the scenario. And uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, if you did, uh, hit that thumbs up button. And uh, comment, rate, and subscribe, guys.